Got a couple new lights I want to show you today. The Flat Par QWH5 and the Flat Par QA5, both from American DJ. They're both a little different. The WH5 produces red, green, blue, and white LED. The WA5 produces red, green, blue, and amber LED. They are quad LEDs. All those colors, all those four colors within each diode here. There are five diodes, five watts apiece. Check it out. Let's take a closer look. This is the QWH5 and this is the QA5. They look alike except for the letterings. You have one, two, three, four, five quad LEDs, five watts apiece, total of 25 watts of LED per fixture. You have an adjustable yoke on here. You make it tall or you can make it short. Alternately, you can completely remove the yoke or swing it out of the way. On the back, you'll notice all of your controls are here, all of your LCD controls and modes set up, up, down, color mixing programs, all kinds of neat stuff in here. DMX channel addressing and also channel mode. But you can swing your yoke completely out of the way. And because of the rubber feet on the bottom here, it won't affect your LCD menu at all. You can lay that light flat down like this on any surface. Now, also, very cool stuff. If you notice, you've got your AC and DMX out on this side, and your AC and DMX in on this side, so all of your cables are going to come in this side, and out that side makes a real nice, neat setup. Some people may be wondering, how bright are these lights? Well, let's go ahead and take them outside and blow up the side of the house and take a look. On the left, we have the QA5 doing its beautiful full-on amber. And on the right, we have the QWH5 doing its beautiful full-on white. Now, let's focus on the QW5 for a minute. Although, you cannot produce a better amber than you can with an amber LED, you can kind of produce an amber using red and green if you have either tri or quad LEDs. They mix well that way. Regular RGB LEDs don't do so well, but with a quad or a tri, you can definitely do it. All you have to do is give yourself full on red and then add green until you have the amber you like. Now, that's pretty close to what's going on on the left. It's not as nice or as brilliant, but it works. But here's the real benefit of having white. Besides going full on white, which is nice, you can do colors like pink, which you cannot achieve without a white. Focusing our attention on the left, the QA5, although it does not have a white diode, you can achieve kind of a white if you go full on red, green, and blue. And again, as you can see, it's not quite the white that the QWH5 produces. But you know, it's kind of like when you go to Best Buy and there's like 60 TVs on the wall. Some look more brilliant than others. But if you buy one that's not the best one you bring it home, you're not going to know the difference. However, if you feel like your clients might know the difference, you're going to have to go with the quad LED light that produces the light that you need. If you have any questions, let us know down here in the comment section as always. Once again, the new Flat Par QWH5 and the Flat Par QA5, both from American DJ. You can do stuff with these lights that you can't do with traditional RGB or even tri-LED. So again, any questions, let us know down here. Practice and enjoy.